follow, subscribe, and share. Have a nice day. AG here, day 27. One more day and we have four weeks. You guys are killing it, great job. My weight, 188.8. Been a little bit more consistent with my breakfast is probably the reason why I am slowly working my way down. That is the first time I've been below 189. And let's see if it stays there, we shall see. My cardio activity. That is six minutes on the bike in the morning after I eat, four minutes of planking after lunch, and in the evening after dinner, I spend 20 minutes with the wife. We've done yoga four days in a row, I think now. It's actually pretty cool. I really need the stretching, especially my lower extremities, but enough on that. Training. Training, I'm always starting with a warm up of 20 minutes on the treadmill, 1.5, no expectations, 5.0 on the slope, and wherever I end up at the end always changes. So it's always different, just depends on how I feel. Today we're gonna to be training chest and back, and what I'd like to see is four exercises for each body part. Also, I'd like to see if you can make some of those exercises a little bit different. So that might require you to get online, watch a few videos on the variety that's out there. Food. I am still on the five meal plan. I am eating three meals on point. I'll remind you a few more times that on point for us means the scheduled time for that meal eating from our lists and eating the specific amount that we want that is eating on point for three meals. Look, if you guys are at one or two and then you're eating a decent breakfast and the right dinner, look, this is a gradual progression to eating properly, gradual progression to increasing your cardio activity, gradual progression of adding a bunch of things all around to remind you psychological re psychological cues to remind you of everything we're doing. So with that being said, keep in mind, we do want you to eat from your lists. I'd like for you to start thinking about breakfast. You have enough data to actually begin to create a game plan and build some breakfast meals. And then you just choose from a few of those. Sometimes you can deviate because, again, this is a flexible diet. We want you to enjoy yourself. We want you to eat the food you want. And at times, you're going to deviate a little bit. And it's, it's what we do. Let me also mention that we must not disrespect our dinner because we're paying attention to our breakfast and, of course, the three meals on point. All this stuff has to be measured. If you find something new that you want to eat, just add it to your list. I will say again, it's, it's certainly convenient for you to be able to transfer something that you know what it weighs with a measuring cup because it simplifies making the prep, food prep. Water, one gallon. Other things to keep in mind, Tomorrow's an off day, so you can go a little bit harder on chest and back. Get some soreness in there. Don't forget the variety. You have enough data from breakfast. Feel free to dive into building meals. This also brings me back to the saying that I say a lot. Stop being lazy towards yourself. Put in the work, guys, to make this program specific because you are not going to find one any easier. No trainer is going to have you a month out just starting certain things. You know what I'm saying? A month out. It's a gradual progression. That's what this is. This is going to be a lifestyle change, and you're going to get to the weight and everything you want. So let's go. Like, like subscribe, comment, and share to my dad's, dad's channel. channel.